Hello folks, Andy here. Welcome back to the boat build. Just prepping the inside of the boat today because it's getting um, foam insulated in a couple of days. So we've just put finished putting the decking boards down. So the timbers that support the decking board and then we're just cutting the decking boards and putting them in. We've not put the ballast in yet but we're just getting it ready for the spray foaming. So we'll have a look at actually putting the boards in. Right. So you can see the framework down there, it's 35mm thick that timber and then the board's on top so we're just cutting them to size now and notching etc to go around bits and bobs and then they'll go in but they will all be coming out so we can uh, do the ballast in the bottom but we're just going to do it this way because we haven't got the ballast yet. So it'll all be spray filmed uh, next, probably next time you see in here. Well that's not engaged yet. Take these, take it back so you can get them out. Take it off. We're <laughs> you need to see what we've got here. I'm going to make a YouTube video and say how many people need to take the test I'll be getting back out again in a minute and pass some bits back in. How uh, do you want to do this? Do you want to measure it? Or? We've got to get measurement up to there, aren't we, first? Right. Okay. Trim it on. Are you trimming it rather than notching it? No, yeah. you've got to get just hold that. You five ninety tight up to there. Is it here? Bit same on it. Yeah. So that one's cutting down now. It's running through so. Right. Take it all on. Okay. Yeah. So you so take this one back out. Well, you, you can leave that one to do another one. Yeah. Well, lift this one back up out of way then. Okay. Yeah. Just yeah. That square. We're all going to leave that underneath and tell you then when you're oh, yeah. it down. Ah. Uh. <laughs> yeah. So that one's notching. Right. I'll just pull it back. It's notching. And I'm just going to notch that bit. And then I'll get it here. Put it on here. We can do, yeah. So if
just dug in half. All the way. All the way. All the way, man. All the way, Percy. To let it go up, mate. Yeah. I'll cut a bit off now, then. to go on, yeah. It's you don't need to screw frame down over here as long as it's just sat with the floor on. So but it needs a... Um, well, we'll have a look, might run some timbers through now and then I could spray foam them all in. <laughs> yeah. We'll do that. I'm just thinking before you go too far with floor and you can't get to what you need to put in, it's just, if you, this floor's continuing through, yeah, another I don't know where middle, it, Another middle one's going to go right over that, innit? I don't know where it goes to. I know I measured right up to end. So there's another full one for you in it, I know. No, he's got to cut down on it. 2.4. He's got to cut oh, it. Right. Takes you right up there. Is that still 590? Yep. Right, one we'll up another board. Just don't know which one. If there's one with a smashed edge, we'll use that. Yes, there it is. I can think there's a face up there looking in, it's that real wire. <laughs> can you see how I'm calling me out like a face, somebody looking in. Yeah, it certainly is. So is that that at back now, wherever you, however you put your tips under these, sort of stick to floor us? That's better than doing that staggered joint. It is, yeah, I forgot about it, Pete. I did, uh, completely you know, forgot. When we do that, which spaces, can't you deviate the floor and stick them in? Anything that makes it stick down. Because I'm thinking of PVA, you can paste that on and it's just... Yeah, you could use you P PVA and do it. Yeah. It's cheaper than. It's cheaper. It's cheaper. A lot cheaper than paint. It's. Uh, we'll do that. PVA. Then. PVA. Well done, that man. Right. We need to pass a sheet in then. Which sheet you want? Uh, uh, the full one or uh, the starting one? one. This other cut one. Yes. Yeah. And then we need to. We'll have to trim it up there. Right. We're going to get this in because of the curve, aren't we?
two ten. Just the pull on two ten. Yeah. Do I cut that out of there? Uh, can do. Well, we want the two ten. And another one same as this one. Yeah, should be, shouldn't it? Four. To rip it in weights. All right. And lens. Okay. Floor's down now, and we'll be prepping it for the spray foam on Tuesday. So it's all closed off windows like this. All taped up on outside. Inside. Uh, it's a bit dark and the old lights are out but all the timber's been faced with masking tape so when it's spray foamed it's easy to get it off the faces that's uh, important we don't want them covered in spray foam otherwise we'd have an almighty job cleaning it all off so the floor's all plastic covered now all the sides so it's now ready for spray foam. Uh, unfortunately I won't be here when it's spray foamed. So I don't think we've got any footage of it. So the next time it'll be, it'll come back in an ear, it'll be spray foamed. And uh, the floor has got to come up again and the ballast in. Uh, it's not a problem, it's just how we've had to do it like that. Well that's it for now. It's uh, at a stage for spray foaming and that's it. So I'll be back in a few days and uh, we'll carry on. And we'll have to get that bottom done then, get the ballast in. So, all right, thanks for watching everybody and hope you're enjoying this build. It is beginning to look like it's uh, turning into a boat now, not just a building site. <laughs> so anyway, all right, see you all. Ta-ra!